Hey folks, welcome back to the Horde again today. About 2 o'clock, Monday, it's still April Fool's Day, 55 degrees outside. Batteries were all nice and charged up. What am I up to? Well, back to the Mojave. I broke um, the pivot. Uh, let's call it the pivot bolt, the pivot shaft, whatever one wants to call it. And this is it sitting here. So what I did is I... I obviously cleaned it up, cut a nice uh, V in it, so to speak, filled the well in. Um, this is how I kept it straight. I used a piece of angle iron. I thought of it, and then um, Wally recommended it, so uh, obviously he's had to fight these kind of battles also. To take this out and not have to drop the whole rear end and take the chain off and all. I was going to use some of this rebar, but it was too thick. So I found this old bicycle out back, and I cut a piece of it off from here to here, and I used that to push it through. So hopefully um, this works better. What I did is um, I slowed the feed down on the welder quite a lot so I put a lot more heat there um, and put the metal on a lot slower last time I did it I kinda I kinda just glommed it on there and ground it um, down um, this time I went really slow the weld was very very hard to grind it took a long time I've been you know like a minute welding or less 30 seconds welding and then the next 20 minutes grinding off most of the material and then tacking it back on again so you can see this is the part of the bicycle I jammed through here now I have to rejam this through and uh, hopefully it doesn't fight me but uh, we all know it's probably going to So, let's see if we can uh, do the one-handed man here and that. That's not going to cooperate. So anyway, I'm going to put it back together again. Hopefully swap out the gas tank, get this whole thing running. And then we could, uh, we could, take, we could take a ride on it. Um, now that this one's almost done, i got to start thinking about who's next. Who's next in the lineup? Obviously, I have the um, um, DX225 that I'm going to put together as a kind of rat rod, so that's in there. Um, and I guess I have that guy up there. I don't know if you guys can see it behind all the crap. That's the uh, 200SX. Um, I've been sniffing around for plastic for that thing. And I can't even find beat-to-death plastic for it anywhere. Uh, to go to Mayer or to uh, to get some new old stock, I mean, I'm looking at a $500 bill, and homie ain't dropping $500 um, worth of plastic on a $300 um, quad. So, I don't know. Who knows, maybe I'll try to see if this, this I could do something with it, maybe patch it up, or one of the other bikes. I also, I'm faintly remembering that, that I had put a bunch of plastic aside somewhere. I don't think I got rid of it. Um, so, I don't know, I gotta, I gotta go through the hoard. Ah, uh, yes, the hoard. All right, folks, live, love, and have a great time. Tires down, hill the bars up, and we'll catch you on the next episode, at which time you hear hopefully something running and going up and down the driveway. Take care now.